Yo, what's going on guys? Average Tech Guy here and today we are back with another controller review. Uh, with iPad OS, we know that we're gonna get this whole new world of gaming opening up on iPad. So I want you guys to be prepared and have the best controller. We've done PS4, we've done Xbox. Now we're using the Steel Series. This is the Nimbus wireless controller. Let's check it out. So before we get started, I'm gonna actually show you the box. Now, this is all you get. You get the controller and you get some instructions. That's all you get. It charges through a lightning cable. You don't get that in the box. So, I mean, for 50 bucks, they should have been able to give you a, a lightning cable. Um, this is actually what it is made for though. So it's made for the Apple TV, the Apple 6S Plus, 6S, 6 Plus, 6, it's all these Apple devices. We're worried about iPad Pro, iPad Air 2, iPad Air, all these iPads. So all the iPads pretty much should be able to use this and most of the phones should be able to use this. So I got iPad Pro right here, iPad Pro 11. I'm gonna set the box to the side. Now, already have this connected. We just now wanna make sure it works. In order to see how this is connected though, I'm gonna leave a video link down below to show you how to connect your controller. Most people think it's as easy as going here, going to Bluetooth, activating your Bluetooth and turning it on. I didn't do that through here. Um, I'm gonna disconnect or forget this device. So let's forget this device. I'm in the regular Bluetooth and this is now in a pairing mode. I'm gonna just hold this button down. And there we go. So it's looking, it's looking, and you see nothing's popping up. So I had a couple of questions in a previous video of why did I have to go to accessibility? So you have to go here and you have to go to switch control, go to switches, Bluetooth device, and Nimbus now pops up. These are the steps that you have to take for right now. You can't just go into your Bluetooth setting and turn this on. So I just wanted to go ahead and clear that up. It is connected, we are good to go. So once we actually get our Nimbus connected through that actual switch control, now you're gonna have to go to touch and turn on your assistive touch. If your assistive touch is not turned on, the Nimbus will not work with your iPad. I'm gonna use asphalt again. And once you go into asphalt, now you notice your buttons are working. So there we go. Buttons are working. You're able to play. And let's do this. I'm gonna actually just start up a quick race just to show you guys how it's gonna work. To put that out a little bit in front of me so you can see it. Let's do this. Here we go. So I did play it just a little bit and it handles really smooth. Um, controls work really well. So it's really a, let's get out of that. It's a real good contender for the PS4 controller as well as the Xbox wireless controller. And I really think that these all are gonna come down to comfort level, which one feels the best in your hand and which one has the better price. So I'm gonna be comparing these in another video just to show you guys, you know, I'll give you prices, I'll give you spec breakdowns, everything that you'll need to know. Now, I got a quick, I got a question about the actual rumble feature in the Xbox controller. Xbox controller rumble feature does not work. So there's no vibration in the Xbox controller. There's actually no vibration in this controller as well. But this controller really feels good in the hand. It fits, It. Um, I don't have any issues with it. It's really comfortable. I'm gonna have to pit it up against the other controllers just to see how it's going to work out. But for now, this has been the Steel Series Nimbus controller. This is the controller for the iPads, the iPhones, the Apple TVs. Um, it's a pretty good buy, 50 bucks. You can go check it out, Best Buy, Walmart, get it on Amazon. Uh, I'll drop a link below. Hopefully this is able to help someone out. Until next time, be sure to give me that thumbs up. Please subscribe, Average Tech Guy out. Peace.